guys back with Final Space for our season two episode five. It's called the Notorious Mrs. Good Speed. So guys, can't wait to see this next episode. Last episode was really great. I enjoyed everything about it. It was just it was pretty interesting. I wasn't expecting it to be that way when they crashed the ship into the purple thing and then uh, little Kyle was on the other side. I thought everyone I thought everyone else was on the other side because they made it look like it was just only Gary that was lost, but he wasn't. It was basically little Kato was the only one that was lost. He thought they were gone for like 60 years because it, it felt like it to him and they weren't. He was probably gone for like maybe, I bet, 10 minutes if that, but it described it like it was 60 years later. I was like, how is this 60 years? I'm like, they've been there that long? I'm like, probably everyone's dead and gone. I'm just like, but they weren't. They were, uh, you know, Gary was on the Gary and the team was on the other side the whole time. Hey guys, I definitely can't wait to get to this next episode for Final Space. But before this video begins, guys, I want to thank Brian for sponsoring this video through the Patreon page. Make sure you guys go on the Patreon page to get the full reaction and then also support the channel as well. And then, I guys, let's get into this next episode for Final Space. Power cells for the ship. Check. Go down, little Kato. Party starts when we find these dimensional keys. <laughs> Star Wars, hey, the Tauntauns. Really? Do we have company? Are you Gary Goodspeed? What if I am? We have business with them! Recognize them! That might... My arm! Melody avenge you! Whoa! Why are they after you? Wore the skin of their dead mother. It's a long story. Quit missing Oh, yeah, I remember he did. Yeah. Hugh, start the engines. You can always count on Hugh too quickly. Engines are a go. All I had left were the engines, Ava. And now you have taken that, too. <laughs> Hey, Where are you? Ever since the day I held the torn flesh sack of my beloved Melody, I took the kids out of school. Hello, mommy. I emptied my savings to hunt you down. And we're gonna hunt your mother down. Simply wore her skin. Plus, you don't even know where my mom is. You already found her. You did? What? On planet Sorbo. Amazing the tale. This has been great. Uh, but gotta jump. <laughs> Oh, it's not the last time we're gonna see kids. <laughs> it's kids. Stay in school. It's not the last time we're gonna see him. Execution of a lifetime. Tomorrow, prisoner Y, the most notorious criminal in this star system, will be put to death. That's my uh That's my mom. mom. Just want to dip her fingers in honey and stir my tea with it. You really, know, Clarence? Guy stuff? And cake? Either he's distracted or he's had breakfast. Or I just don't want a pancake. Where are you going? See my mom before she gets executed. To save her life? Oh, heavens no. Why would I want to do that? Oh. You want to save your mom's life? So heartwarming. Welcome to Sorbo Supermax Prison, where it's our privilege to kill you. Yeah, that's, ple that's well, pleasant. Just hold on a second there. What is your business here? Here to survey the cells. For the saber bat. Uh, so we came right now. Uh, was there Wesley in the front office? Good old front office Wesley. Yeah, front office Wesley's a bit of a prayer. Hey, Wesley's my brother. You <laughs> can't agree to me calling him a prayer. Personally, it's all 15 footer rip my best friend Carlos in half. Oh. Lasted for 21 days. So much screaming. Anyway, good luck. <laughs> okay. Oh, if they're still killing Carlos, tell him I say hey. They're still killing him? Maybe I should also throw in, what kind of a mom walks out on a kid after his dad dies? She doesn't hear from her ever about anything ever again. Harry? Oh, no. Mom, she's even more tantalizing than my groin suggested. Oh my god. You know I should be going. Harry. Yeah? Nice seeing you. It was? Really? You, you mean it? I do. Now, who are your friends? Clarence. I'm the proud owner of your son. What are you doing with your body? No reason. Just curious. <laughs> They're so prisoner. gross. Prisoner. Why? <laughs> autograph my face. Please autograph my face. Oh, uh, what you been up to? I mean, other than getting sentenced to death. Same. Never get a chance to tell you, eh? Mom! Oh. Oh. Mom, oh. stop! Faster! Will you get Faster, off? you beast! Oh, yeah, oh, get off, Claire. Oh, my god. She's good. Hey, Gary. You don't happen to have a ship. Yes! Yes, I have a ship! Just be crowding you. No, you wouldn't! Seriously! Come on! Then left to Carlos? Yeah, he's still dying! <laughs> yeah. That's Carlos, right? What happened was me thinking this is gonna be a cakewalk, but just my luck, a drop of Yidrian venom gets on my shirt and boom! Disintegrated! <laughs> uh, give me a break. Uh, come here. Let me show you my collectibles. Tribor, love what you've got going on, mate. But can I make an itty bitty suggestion? Just away, hot mama. Did that just happen? Yes. Yes, it did. 
I feel like a czar. Um, wow. Do me next. Okie doke. What about? Huh. Oh. This. It's perfect. I know you're happy your mom's back, but just watch out for this. My man nips. Your heart. Right. Yeah. Forget it's about it's gonna be broken. Heart. Our power cells are close to empty. Guys, it's not the power cell. Versus the intake valves, you can recycle your power like this. Full power has been restored. That's awesome. No, this ship would be good for... Oh, no. It's too dangerous. What? Uh, it's, it's just a little job. Kind of job, my little lemon uh. biscuit. Some very bad people stole something that belonged to someone. An ancient family heirloom. It's located in the polyhedron fortress. It sounds a lot like you're pulling a bank robbery. Well, the heirloom's not theirs. We're just... Stealing it back. Like a danger field reverse robbery. I love those. Good. Can you fly? I'm gonna fly so good. She's using them. I'm gonna them. fly so hard. Feel that. That's 14 years. I like that. Right. Synchronize the ship with the rotation of the fortress. Gary and I will go in together. That's totally awesome. Yes! Trokity? Let me ask my mom. Mom, can Mooncake come with? Nope. Just you and me. Sorry, little buddy. I can get you in with the eye of fur. Nobody wants to see your fur eye. With it, I can teleport anywhere my heart desires. Into that fortress and then into your mom's fortress. You know which one. Ugh. Can't you see she's a con artist? I know. I'm looking for her. Are you? I'd watch my mouth, kiddo. You're good at finding stuff. Why didn't you try finding your son? How do you know I didn't? Not buying it. Hold on, Nightfall. I want to do this. Let's go, son. Huh? Yeah, there's something going on with nice. her mom. They don't like it. Precious pancake vault. It's been violated. Oh, heavens. My sweet baby age. Like you a little bit stressed. Who made him stressed? Hey, kid. I was born ready. Actually, you were born during the rinse cycle of a hover car wash. Oh, well, that would explain a lot, actually. Well, chin up. You are the son of a beloved hero and a notorious criminal. Here we go. Oh. oh crap. He's just glad you to spend time with her. Oh my god, he's getting fat. Out of pancakes again. They're selling like never mind. I have an idea. But it all depends on whether we have. <laughs> hey little buddy. Think you know why we're here. Intervention. Yeah, That's talk about move. his feelings. Hello, primate. The hell did you get in there? And do not say the eye, eye of fur. It's one of the most valuable pieces of technology in the universe. <laughs> oh, come well, on, Clarence. Cake, no matter oh what size you are, and right now it's around a 42. It's okay with us. Make sure that you're complete. Oh my wow. guy's fat. Get him, boy. <laughs> Help! He's eating me alive! He hit Fox. And you snag the gem. Oh, no. Hurry up! Hurry up, grab it! That's definitely for, like Star Wars type of thing. think the back flip was necessary given the situation, but okay. Buddy, you're kidding me. Will you stop your crotch? Is in my eyes? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nice. Please don't need us. Is this about losing your powers or Gary not wanting to hang with you? Don't worry, Mooncake. If I could crack Gary's brain open and unfold it, you'd see all the love that's in there. And Gary's not the only one who loves you. We do too, Little Biscuit. Ew. He's gonna throw it all up. Pretty good pep talk. How did the reverse robbery go? And don't you leave out any details. Oh. <laughs> I know, my mom was amazing. Things a mother will do. Mom, come on, let's celebrate. Nah, get some shut eye. There'll be more adventures tomorrow. She's gonna leave. That don't sound, she's about to leave. Yup, knew it. Hello, dimensional key. What? What? 
Oh, so you got leaving. Again. I think we both knew this was never meant to be forever. Why don't you want anything to do with me? Whatever was left was too small to love anything anymore. Yeah. You see, I would have taken a, even a tiny piece. Maybe in another life, eh? But not this one. See you around, kiddo. Damn. Ta da! <laughs> oh, I guess I did the big shave for nothing. Well, they gotta go get her. Yes, a dimensional key. How did you know? She's good at taking what's important to me. That woman hasn't seen the last of me. Definitely not. It's on. Hey guys, that was a really good episode. I felt so bad for Gary, honestly. Like, her, his mom just... I get where his mom was coming from and how she was feeling, but at the same time, like, that's your son. Like, you have no type of love for him at all, or maybe a little bit? No, I'm not really. I mean, she just completely abandoned him at the time, and I can see why Gary feels the way he feels. He feels like, how could how could you? How could you abandon me like that? I mean, I don't think his even his own father would do that, but she did that. I mean, you could definitely tell she is a con artist. I mean, I gotta agree with Future Quinn on that, man. She definitely is. But I don't know. Maybe she'll come around. I want to be, you know, positive about it, but at the same time, I can, you know, it, it's definitely on, man. You know, Gary definitely needs to get that dimensional key back from. You know his mother he just felt bad for gary and how it was with his life you know he just was completely by himself definitely when you know he needed her clarence was just a freaking pervert man like he was just funny he was funny in this episode and just the way he was just trying to get to you know get with you know gary's mom yeah, i definitely can't wait to see the next episode to see how they're gonna get that uh, dimensional key from his mom and he's definitely have to fight for it though that's that's i know that for a fact uh, please post your comments down below tell me what you think about this awesome episode for final space make sure you guys go on the patreon page to get the full reaction on there and also support the channel as well other than that guys hope you guys have a wonderful day i'll see you guys next final space